Hello YouTube, it's Mark from Spending Wages here and today I'm going to be bringing you a short video on how to upgrade, increase the memory or RAM, whatever you want to call it, of an iMac. So let's get started. First of all, you want to get yourself an anti-static wrist strap and you're also going to need some sort of screwdriver like the one you can see in front of you now. Secure the anti-static wrist strap to your iMac like so. Here's a look at the memory I'm going to be installing, two 8 gig cards. You then need to find a working area that is going to give you easy access to this part of the iMac which is underneath the Apple logo. Now go ahead and unscrew the three screws. I don't know why I don't in this clip. Instead I'm messing about with the video camera but you get the idea. This is what it looks like on the inside. What you need to do now is pull out the existing memory that is inside the iMac. This is done by pulling hard on this black kind of material toggle thing whatever it's called I don't know um, and there you go this can be tough but once released the memory should slide out with ease take note of how the memory looks when it first comes out here the longer connection is to the left here's what things look like when they have been laid out ready to be replaced so now it's time to install a new memory here I'm jumping from 8 gig of RAM to 16 gig of RAM and it's really important that the new memory is installed in the same way that the old memory was removed and as you can see you have to push quite hard to secure the memory in place you will know when this has been done because you will feel like a connection has been made if you know what I mean now onto the other 8 gig of memory the first time I tried this my iMac would not power up and the reason for this was because I did not secure the memory in far enough so if this happens to you just go back and give each bit of memory an extra shove to get them in place and that way everything should be fine. So that's really all there is to it. I'll put a link in the description of where I purchased my memory from. Um, it may be used to you, it may not, but hey. The last thing you want to do is close down and then for me I had to then lug my iMac back into my bedroom and as you know these things are heavy and they're quite big and it was, well, a nightmare. Before you shoot off, here's a quick look at about this Mac. And as you can see, my memory now stands at 16 gig. So that's all from me. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Take care.